All right, here's the initial uh, results, that group I just shot. And it's extremely capable. And looks about, you know, the whole group, there's one, there's three shots in there, and then there's one here. And uh, that's with the uh, XM193 ammo, the 55 grain stuff, the standard uh, mil spec, so to speak. So this rifle definitely has it, uh, in my opinion. Um, yeah, I really do like this rifle. As you can see, there's no other marks. You can see that's not a bullet mark. No other impacts on this at all. And it's hard to say whether this was the round or me. Most likely that was me. That was my error. But you can see that's about, uh, it's about a half MOA. Maybe just a hair over half MOA hole, and I am impressed with this Bushmaster Varminter. I'm extremely impressed. So, in any case, um, that's pretty damn good for the first outing, and that's again with the 55 grain XM193 uh, standard ammo that you get in the boxes. Uh, Federal, it's the Lake City, uh, made in Lake City from Federal. You can see there's no wind out here today. We're just sitting at 100 yards for right now, and uh, it's pretty much no wind. It's sitting right about 80 degrees. Barometric pressure is sitting right at about 29.92-ish. Um, not that it matters so much at 100 yards. But in any case, this rifle definitely is a shooter. Uh, if I throw some uh, match ammunition in it, which I'm going to play around with, if I throw some good match ammo in it, uh, some good varmint type ammo, maybe do some hand loads, I'm going to be shooting a ragged hole at 100 yards every time. So, all right. Thanks a lot for watching.